So today guys, I bring you an incredible glitch which will see you earning millions of XP in seconds and take your quick hacking skill from a 0 to a 20 in literally seconds. This is that crazy. How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more cyberpunk on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. Also guys, to give back to you amazing people for the amazing support on my channel since this game has dropped, I am giving one lucky person per week the chance to win a game of their choice. To enter my weekly giveaway, simply drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed with notifications turned on. Good luck. So there is another quick hacking glitch which is kind of quick in earning that quick hacking XP but it consists of you driving back and forth for about 10 minutes scanning and pinging a camera. It's a video I covered about a week and a half back. Yes it's good but this is miles better as this can truly take your character from a level 0 to 20 in mere seconds. So this glitch consists of you being able to get a quick hacking shard within your inventory. This shard in inventory situation does have a few people confused, as normally with the XP shards as soon as you pick them up, they auto use. So how is it one is in your inventory you're probably wondering? Well guys it happens quite easily, and it's due to there being certain places on the map which you can loot, which beholds two of the same shard. You've probably seen the hand cannon shard XP glitch, as there's a guy on the map who has two on him. If you select to take all and pick everything up at the same time, what this does is it activates one of the XP shards so that gets auto used, but the second one goes into your inventory. This means you can dupe it people, and in duping it comes tons of XP. And while today I bring you the location of where you can find two of the quick hacking XP shards within the same place. So when you pick them up, one gets used and one goes into your inventory allowing you to dupe it. And as far as I am aware, these can be gotten from the get-go. I went here on my lowest level character, who is around that level 16, and these were here for me to grab. You probably have to complete the prologue first, but after that I think you're good to go here people. So located on the map right here we can see an Assault and Progress side mission. If you go here, take out the enemies around this building, you can simply then go up to this bag and you can see it beholds two of that quick hacking XP shard. Now it's as simple as selecting to take all. For me on Xbox that's hold X, on Playstation I'm guessing it's hold square and on PC I ain't sure. What will happen here is one will automatically be used you'll see that pop up on your screen. The next one though will go straight into your backpack. And while then guys it's all about duping it but there is a slight change here in how this works so you gotta listen carefully. So head to any drop point on your map. And once you are here, it's about entering that duplication glitch mold. If you don't know how this is done, it's quite simple. Stand in front of the drop point machine. This can work on any drop point machine on the map. Then on Xbox, press the Y button and the home button at the same time. On PlayStation, I believe it's triangle and pause, and on PC, it's alt and R. If done correctly, you'll see that the background of the drop point menu looks transparent, and the top left text with your level is half out the screen. This means it's worked. But if I were you and you're doing this for the first time, I'd probably create a manual save with that shard in your backpack. So do this glitch guys. Now normally as you know to dupe items, you first have to sell them to the machine, then back out and then use this glitch, go back in and spam the item you just sold the machine. But with this shard it doesn't work like that. You need to do the glitch and then sell the shard to the drop point. And you need to sell them singly. So yes, as soon as you get to a drop point machine, use the glitch straight away. When the glitch has worked, sell the machine them singly by spamming that button. Each one you sell adds XP to your quick hacking perk. If you spam them, you can literally earn limitless XP in seconds, which will see you max out quick hacking in a game seconds. A couple of drawbacks you might encounter, the machine may run out of money, as don't forget you are selling them to the machine. If this happens to you before you reach that level 20, it's simple. Here just rebuy two shards and then reset the time by 24 hours in game. But it's important you buy back two people because one disappears. Once you have done this, you are left with one shard back in your inventory. And like I said, do this because it only seems to work when selling one shard at a time. Could it be an extra glitch for me, but don't take any chances. 
So with one shard back in your inventory, if you do encounter the problem where the machine runs out of money, do the glitch again and spam sell the machine, the quick hack and XP shards. And you will be done people, you'll be leveled up in seconds. So do as you please and earn that quick hacking XP in mere seconds guys. Don't forget your quick hacking level will be locked to whatever your intelligence level is. So if your intelligence level is at an 8, the max your quick hacking will go up to is an 8. Level up your intelligence with attribute points which are unlocked for leveling up your main level. Your attributes and perk skills max out at a level 20 and that's the highest you will see them go up to. And yes guys, well the end of the video is here and I hope it helps you out. If you have any questions and can't reach me in the comments section because I do get a ton of comments, you can always hit me up on Twitter, link down below, or you can hit me up on my Discord, just come and join, send me a DM and I will get back to you. But yes guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, I really do. Smashing the like button helps me out. If you're new around here and want to see more Cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video or upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.